Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and I hope you're having a great day. So guys, today we're going to talk, as per the title, every man should have this shoe. This is a shoe that, for me, is probably one of the most versatile out there. Um, just before we jump into the shoe itself, let's see if you can guess what shoe it is. Now we're talking about a shoe that's been around for close to 200 years. We're talking about a shoe that is still as fashionable today as it ever has been, maybe if not more so. We're talking about a shoe that's um, been seen on the feet of some of the coolest men walking the planet. You know, if we go back to the 50s and 60s, we're talking people like uh, Mick Jagger, Mark Bolan, uh, the Beatles. And if we fast forward to today, we're talking people like uh, Kanye West, Jerry Lorenzo from Fear of God, uh, David Beckham, just to name a few. These are people that you will see wearing this shoe constantly, purely because of how versatile it is. Now, one more clue before we bring the shoe out, but one more clue is if you was around in the 50s and 60s, and I'm guessing you possibly wasn't, but if you was, you would already know probably the shoe that I'm about to talk about. But if you was around in the 50s and 60s, and more specifically, if you was hanging around the King's Road area uh, of West London in the 50s and 60s, which was a seriously fashionable, trendy area, as was Carnaby Street in Soho, then you would definitely already got it. Have you got it? Do you know what the shoe is? No? It's the Chelsea boot. This is the shoe, guys. Um, as I said, probably one of the most versatile shoes out there. Um, and the thing with the Chelsea boot is that, as we said just now, sneakers are not always appropriate. But what's great about this shoe is, and if you have a quick look on Google and you know do some I don't know, Chelsea boot outfits, you'll see that this shoe is basically being worn in every kind of way that you can possibly think of. So you know it's being used mixed um it's being used as a streetwear item so it's being mixed with streetwear clothing you know baggy t-shirts and layering and stuff like that and distressed jeans and stuff like that so it's being used in the streetwear culture um if you're going out maybe you're going out for the night to a restaurant you know with your wife your girlfriend or family friends whatever it may be again sneakers are not going to be appropriate but this shoe always is so you know you match this with a nice bit of denim or a pair of chinos and a, a nice shirt nice belt you're good to go so smart casual this is your shoe again and then if you're going for something a little bit more formal so it could just be i don't know maybe you work in a office and you need formal attire or it could be a wedding or something similar to that then you could also wear the chelsea boot i'd probably suggest in a leather version um, but you could wear the chelsea boot as well for a formal function so Guys, tell me another shoe that can do all of those, that can be worn in streetwear, that can be worn casual and can be worn in a formal environment. I don't think there is one if I'm completely honest with you. So this shoe is the one that you need to buy. Now, um, obviously Chelsea boots come in lots of different colors and lots of different styles as well. You know, you can get them with the elasticated gusset, you can get them with zips, you can get them in suede, you can get them in leather, whatever style you want. Um, one of the things, and again, even with the toe box actually as well, you can get the round toe box such as this one, or you can go for the more pointed. You can even get flat, uh, flat toe uh, Chelsea boots as well. So it really depends what you're looking for. But one of the things that I particularly always look for when I'm looking to buy a Chelsea boot is the actual uh, sole itself. I'm not really a fan of uh, the soles that are bigger than the actual shoe. So what I mean by that, when you look down on this shoe, you can see that there's no, you can't actually see any sole at all. You can see the upper, that's all you can see. Whereas you may find with some boots that you can actually see the sole that is running around the edges. I don't like that, it looks like a bit of guttering. Um, you know, I think a Chelsea boot should be nice clean lines and, you know, almost sock-like. So um, that's one of the things that I always look for when I'm purchasing Chelsea boots is that I do want them to be very sort of streamlined in the way they look. Anyway, guys, this is a tan colorway, as you can see. Um, I probably think this is one of the best tan, uh, one of the best colorways you can get is tan because this really looks great with blue jeans. This looks great with uh, black jeans, grey jeans. It really looks great pretty much with anything. So if you are thinking about picking up a pair for the first time, I'd probably suggest going for the tan colorway because again, it's just so practical and versatile. However, if you've already got Chelsea boots, I'd like to bring you on to a brand that maybe you've not heard of before, you've just not tried. Now, 
I bought these uh, about, I think, three or four days ago. Uh, they arrived to me, and I really, really like them. It's a brand that I've not heard of before, um, but it's a brand from the UK, from London. They've been around for around 50 years, and the brand is actually called Walk London. Um, really like the packaging on these. They've done it, as you can see, in like a travel case. Really, really nice packaging. Now, the boots themselves, I have to say, are so, so comfortable. I haven't worn them out for a long du uh, duration. I've stole them a couple of times in the house to see what they look like. The quality seems really, really nice. They feel super soft. They feel almost like I say, like those, a sock on your foot. So yeah, I want to introduce you to this brand because, you know, products don't always have to be stupidly expensive for them to be quality. And I think particularly when it comes to Chelsea boots, you know, Chelsea boots, you can spend fortunes. You can go out and pay for your Yves Saint Laurent ones or whatever brand you want, you know, and, and pay up to a thousand pounds or something more if you want, you know, but you don't have to do that. You know, just because you're paying a lot of money for something doesn't mean it's better than a cheaper version. Now these, I think, are absolutely brilliant. 85 pounds, um, like I say, available from Walk London. Uh, this isn't sponsored by the way this video, but it's just a product that I really, really liked and I didn't want you guys to, to not know about it. 85 pound though from Walk London and they ship worldwide. So it doesn't matter where you're watching this from. If you want a good, practical, well-built Chelsea boot from a brand that's been around for 50 years, this is probably a company worth checking out. Now what I am gonna do is I'm gonna put a link in the description that will just put you straight through to the website. So if you wanna look at what they've got or you wanna pick up this particular shoe, then go for it. So guys, yeah, packaging. Really like it, um, travel case inspired as you can see, and then when you open it up inside, you've got this polka dot, uh, sort of gentleman's style if you like, um, on the inside, which I just think is a really, really, really nice um, start before you open the shoes. You know, it really is just the way they've displayed it. They've really thought about it and done a great job on it. Anyway, guys, I'll pull the boot out. Obviously, it's protected like you'd expect with the paper inside and this is the boot um, as you can see this one is in a uh, grey suede um, again a very practical colour to have probably not quite as practical as the tan if I'm honest with you but definitely a good second place if you already own a tan then these are definitely worth going with um, now as you can see again they're very linear in their design. You can't see the sole at all. All you can see is the upper, so I really, really like that. And these ones are just a little more pointed than the tan pair that I just showed you. So, you know, slightly different style on them. Again, we've got the elastic gusset, and then on the bottom, you can see we've got this kind of uh, nice um, flower design. And I'm not quite sure how they've done that, if I'm honest with you. I think that's just etched in, but it's really nice nonetheless. And then you've got this uh, hand stitching that you can see just here as well. Um, yes guys, really really nice boot anyway. Um, definitely one worth checking out if you have them. Now what I'm going to do is just to show you how versatile the Chelsea boot is. I'm going to put some photos up here now. Um, I'll put some photos up of some guys that you've not seen that I've just found on the internet and I'll put some up of maybe those celebrities that I just mentioned, you know, your Kanye West, your Jerry Lorenzo's. Um, David Beckham etc wearing some outfits but yeah guys anyway it's just a short video for you because you know we do talk about streetwear mainly on this channel and I thought it's probably time that we we start looking at other products all products that are relating to fashion as well because fashion isn't just sneakers and streetwear it really really isn't so guys I'll be interested to see um, if any of you pick these up and if you do please let me know what you think of them like I say absolutely great boot they really are they're super super comfy these will look great, so if you do pick a pair up, please send me some photos in the comments and let me know how you got on with them because I'm sure you're not going to be disappointed with them. Anyway guys, I'm going to wrap the video up. As always, if you've enjoyed the video, please let me know by hitting that like button um, and subscribe as well. I need to, to, to get your subscriptions. I've got a target of a thousand, I keep mentioning, and I think we're like 170-ish now, um, but we're still so far away from it. So the only way I'm going to be able to know if you like this content I'm putting out is by you hitting that like button, but definitely by hitting that subscribe button. Anyway guys, I'll leave you with some photos for some styling ideas on these. Have a great day, whatever you're doing. Peace, speak to you soon.